Yo, what the heck? Kicking this thing off with both, like, a resub from Jack and then also raids for Gaming for Peanut and Gray. Hi! Hello, folks! The type of version was that Legend of Zelda music? Uh... Uh... That was just the stables from Breath of the Wild. But hello, folks! How are we doing today? My model's really small. Why is my model so small? There we go. Hi! <laughs> How's everyone doing? I'm gonna connect my headphones to my capture card so I can actually hear the audio. But hello everyone, and hello Raiders! If you don't know who I am, I'm Appleseed. I'm your friendly neighborhood goblin druid. I do way too much Pokemon content, uh, not enough indie game content. <laughs> and I talk about D&D &D and musical theater way too much. But more than anything, I just like to have a comfy cozy time where we can relax and de-stress from the craziness of life. Because life is crazy, crazy and, and chaotic and hellish, hellish, and I like to escape that. Well, no, no, no! Don't even worry about it. I had the playlist up, so it was easy to check. I was just like, uh. Also, just let me fix. There we go. Okay, so goals for today: we're going to finish. Uh, Pokemon Stadium 2 here. And then we're gonna play something. <laughs> I haven't quite figured out what. Peanut and Gray, what were you guys dreaming? What were you doing? Yeah, we've got the Viridian City Gym and then the Canto Elite 4, and that's it. Oh, you were doing Mod and Stardew! Hell yeah! Okay, I don't even know. I I tried Blue's team last time we streamed this. And it did not go well. Because <laughs> Blue's team is very hard to plan for. <laughs> I had, like, Blue's team pulled up. Which I think is what we gotta do. I'm just gonna pull up Blue's team. But yeah, I'm thinking once we're done this, however long it takes, I'll play some sort of, like, just one-off something. I'm kind of just feeling something that's, like, not very stressful. Like, something that I can kind of play a little mindlessly. And, and not, like, it's nothing big, if that makes sense. Gonna lurk while I get some snackies. You got this. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Pidgeot, Arcanine, Alakazam, Exeggutor, Rhydon, Gyarados. So we're gonna want something electric for sure to do with Pidgeot and Gyarados. Um, water to deal with Rhydon and Arcanine, and then dark. I think that should be our type combination. I think we should do an electric type, a dark type, and a water type. Because we can only take three Pokemon. Could do like... Yeah, no, the rental Pokemon are weird, and we've been doing this entire Gym Leader Castle using them, which has been difficult, to put it, put it in kind terms. Um, but we've been doing it, one way or another. Yeah, I think we'll go Umbreon and Murkrow for the two dark types. Voltorb is a pretty solid electric type because it's got the Rain Dance Thunder combo. 
Which is still so weird for Voltorb to know Rain Dance, but. Um. Yeah, my, my partner pays for it, so admittedly, I don't pay for it myself. He bought it because he specifically wanted to play Kirby 64 again, which is which is valid. I should replay Kirby 64. It's been a hot minute since I played Kirby 64. It's been a hot minute since I played a lot of Kirby games. I need to play more Kirby. I need to have more Kirby in my life. But uh, what else? What else is a good electric type? I mean, Zapdos is good, but Zapdos' move shit set is kind of shit. Electabuzz. Electabuzz was serving us well. We'll do Electabuzz and then two water types. We'll grab, like, not Blastoise. Not a Zoomeril. Not with. Not pre physical special split. Uh. Alligator only has water gun, jeez. Kingdra, maybe? Kingdra's pretty solid all around. Yeah, we'll grab Kingdra and then, like. Dang, Poly World got Billy Drill. Powerful. Um. Maybe Quagsire? No, because Quagsire's special attack isn't great. <sighs> Gotta remember, this is pre physical special split. Oh. Okay, that was weird. I think my capture card just freaked out for a second. Let's grab Starmie. Starmie's solid. I'll try this team. We have Umbreon, a Paralysis, Cure Berry, Murkrow, you can get that. I don't know, I just kind of give these randomly. I never know who to give what. We'll give it a shot. So how's everyone doing on this fine Saturday? I woke up this morning, I had a chat with my mom, because it was her birthday yesterday. Uh, her and my stepdad currently have COVID, so, uh, not the best way to spend her birthday, but she has good spirits despite. And, and they've, they've had it all week, so they're on the mend at least. I'm gonna grab Murkrow, Voltorb, and Starby. I'm gonna also create a little save point here. That way we can just reload this if I suck. Viridian Jim's blue is the opponent. The challenger must stay focused to keep up with his expert Pokemon. I'm determined. I'm determined to beat this gym leader castle and do what I could never as a child. Okay, he leads with Arcanine. So we're gonna swap straight off the hop over to Starmie. Switching Pokemon. That Pokemon must not have been the right choice. There are a lot of games on the Nintendo Switch Online thing. The oh. other trainer is also changing. What are you changing to? You're not allowed to switch. Oh, oh okay, that's still fine. That's all right. We'll destroy that. That's fine. Yeah, send your lamb to the slaughter, please. Cool. All right, nice. That KO will bring out a new Pokemon. So yes, for those who don't know, I've been doing a rental Pokemon only challenge for quite some time in this game. 
and all we have left is a cam to Elite Four after beating Blue here, so. I could never beat this as a child using only rental Pokemon, so I'm trying to do it as an adult. It's not, not been easy, <laughs> but that's okay. It's been fun. I've been having fun with it, and that's what matters. Rental, oh, yes. Because the main thing with this game was that you were able to transfer Pokemon from, like, Pokemon Johto and... Or, from Pokemon Gold, Silver, and Crystal. From, from the Johto region, is what I meant to say. Can we hit it with a Zap Cannon? If I can do this with just Star, I mean, I'll laugh. <laughs> Let's go! Pokemon show signs of Why did I just send Starmie out against his team originally? Oh, Flail. Okay. Alright. But yeah, so you could transfer over Pokemon from the Johto region originally. Uh, but obviously on the... Nintendo Switch Online, they don't have compatibility for that. And as a kid, I didn't have, like, the Link stuff. So I was just like, okay, we're just gonna do, like, normal ass. Normal ass rental Pokemon, which are just standard Pokemon level to level 50. Uh, but they all have really shit movesets. <laughs> or like, a solid 85% of them have really shit movesets. So it's difficult. Alright. The final trainer in the Kanto Gym Leader Castle. Alright. I thought it was, like, the Elite Four. I thought you had to do the Kanto Elite Four before Red. Is it just Red? I guess so. We might be finished this sooner than I thought. I thought I still had, like, another Elite Four to do. <clears throat> okay. I'm looking at his team. He has all of the Johto starters. He has all the Johto starters leveled up to their, like, final forms, obviously. And then he has Tauros, Jolteon, and Caesar. So... What, what types would be effective here? I can get a ground type to deal with Jolteon and Typhlosion. A fire type to deal with Caesar and Meganium. And then Tauros and Feraligator. I think I'm probably best if I use like a grass or electric type. Okay, well, we'll grab Graveler, because Graveler is Earthquake. Um, and that can be for Jolteon and Typhlosion. We really just need any fire type to deal with... Maybe Magmar? To deal with Caesar and Meganium? I think Magmar's good. Um, I 
You can grab a fighting type. Maybe I'll grab a Lectabuzz to deal with for Alligator. I mean, I can only use four, or I can only use three Pokemon. So it's kind of up to some chance. Um... What's a good fighting type that I could that I could have up against a Tauros? <clears throat> Primeape's not bad. But Primeape only has Cross Chop, and Cross Chop doesn't have a great accuracy. Machoke's got Vital Throw. And Dig. So maybe I'll grab Machoke. And then. I'll grab another ground type and another fire type. I'll grab Charizard. And then I'll grab I don't need a king and need a queen to have earthquake. <sighs> um. Fuck it, I'll grab Pilo Swine. Pilo Swine, Pilo Swine. How is that pronounced? Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Red. Okay. I'm gonna try Graveler, Magmar, Electabuzz. I think that's I think that's a solid solid team. Yeah, we're gonna be finished this Pokemon Stadium thing a lot faster than I thought. I still thought I still had like a whole Elite Four to do. That's okay though. Go for it. I gotta fix my tracking, it's bothering me. Hang on. There we go. Okay. Earthquake! Oh, of course you switch. That, that that makes sense, actually. Oh, it's for alligator. It's a for alligator, okay. <clears throat> well, we'll get the earthquake off anyways. Which does good damage just because earthquake. And then we'll swap to a lot of us. You're gonna use Surf on me, which is fine. And then I'm gonna Thunder Punch you. I'm gonna punch you right in the schnoz. I'm gonna deck you on the schnoz. Oh, of course it lives. Granted, barely, but it still lives. No! Don't crit! Fuck off! Shit. Okay. Uh, that's not good. Because I don't know. Um, who's faster? Graveler or Magmar? I have no idea. Who's faster? Uh... Wrath, my compliment to myself is that I ready to go. Uh Oh, it's Magma. The opponent is weak. What an opportunity. The number of remaining Pokémon is two. I'm very friendly. 
like, I, <clears throat> I think I try to be nice and friendly and positive to everyone I encounter. I'm gonna use Confuse Ray and hope that I- oh fuck, of course it has Earthquake. Why wouldn't it have Earthquake? Shit. That's not- that's not good. That's not good. That's not good at all. No, I used- I used fucking Confuse Ray! Shit. Okay. Well, it doesn't matter if I swap. Like, I'm gonna- I'm gonna die. Hang on, Earthquake! Yeah, now nah, you gotta cover it. it has no strength left. Just one Pokemon remains. Okay, um Well, I'm gonna just hope that Graveler can take some hits. The heated action continues. Can I take a counter earthquake? No. Not really. Cool. <sighs> well, maybe if I'm lucky, the AI will not do earthquake for some reason. Never mind. <laughs> Okay, reload. <laughs> okay, we'll try the same team. Finally, the last battle. Red, the last one. The toughest trainers is the opponent. How will the challenger take on the wily veteran? We'll lead with Graveler again. Go for it. Okay, this. Yeah, he leads with Jolteon. It'll probably be a similar, like, swap to for Alligator. His team is the exact same. Yeah, the old Pokemon's trap. Earthquake motherfucker. Exactly! It's effective. Okay, I think his team is probably exactly the same. The trainer switching Pokemon. So we'll go to Electabuzz again. He's gonna use Surf. I'll hit, but... Morning Sticky? Affectionate? What does that mean? And I'm only Sticky because I... Oh, Stinky. Okay. I was like... I'm not... I'm not... The only thing I can think of that would make me sticky is like... Like, tree sap. I can, I can picture Appleseed, like... Having some tree sap leakage. Okay, Jolteon's back out. Um, I'm gonna just swift. Because, again. Yeah. Yes, Got lost in the apple sauce. <laughs> oh, oh god, I just had a horrific. <laughs> I just had a horrifically. lewd thought. <laughs> You fuck the apple. Is, is, is it that you're making applesauce? <laughs> I kinda hate that. I know I'm the one who said it, but I hate it. Okay, Jolteon's gone. Easy. Okay, is it just Tauros? Is Tauros the last one? I don't Just imagine one Tauros is the last one. Remain. Oh, it's yeah. This is the last Pokemon. Okay, we just need to earthquake. Or, or, or hear me out. 
we live, what if we just blow ourselves up? Okay, now that's valid, Rat. What if we just... Do that. Beautiful. Let me get my bomb camera. Oh, I still have one more Pokemon left. He has none. You the Let's go! I did it! I have done what I never could do as a small child. That's it, right? There's no there's no other hidden shit. <laughs> I got the dub duo game boy. What does that mean? Well, now I've got to do the entire Pokemon Stadium. No. Look, I suffered through the entire, like, gym leader castle. I've done enough. I've suffered enough. I think- I think I've suffered... plenty. <laughs> yeah, no, I was fully expecting that to take a lot longer because I thought I had a whole Kanto Elite Four to do. Uh, so now what are we gonna play? That's the question. I, I hadn't really thought about that yet. So let me let me let me browse my like Pokemon. I don't want to play more Pokemon. I do a lot of Pokemon stuff. I do so much Pokemon. I'm I get very Pokemon out. I love Pokemon, but I do so much Pokemon stuff that I'm just like, nah. <clears throat> My plan was to play some sort of like, um, like, like indie game. game. You, you want to ask something, something but you're not sure if it should be a DM, DM or not? Why, why are you unsure? Is it like, is it a weird question? Because, <laughs> I mean... I typically don't, don't give a shit. <laughs> so, <laughs> up to you, really, Raph. If, if you want to DM, DM, that's fine. If you want to ask here, that's fine, too. Um, yeah, I was just gonna play, like, some, some indie something. I just don't know what exactly. Um. Oh, in return, in regards to like the captain stuff, I'll have to ask him when he gets home. I I don't play Magic the Gathering. Those are his cards. Uh. Like the the set that I posted on on my like after dark Twitter. That set. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll have, have to ask, ask him when he gets home. I think they were, I think they were just like the a D and D set specifically. I think I could be wrong on that. Um. Okay, let's see. Uh. Yeah, I just feel like playing something kind of chill and like one off. I don't, I don't want to do anything super big. I just want to like vibe for a few hours, you know. Um, there's an echo? Why is there an echo? There shouldn't be an echo. Why? What? Oh, okay, never mind. It was capturing, after I unplugged my capture card, it was capturing, like, my voice twice. My, my, like, the, the thing that normally captures my capturing 
card was capturing my mic as well. Sorry. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm just gonna list some options. Also, hello, Cass. Uh, what indie should we play? Because I have a lot of, like, short indie games that we could play. Um, and if people want, like, explanations for any of the games, stream today. I don't want to play anything super intense. I just want to like hang out and be able to chat with y'all. Because I feel like it's been a little bit since I've done that. Um, what else do I got that's nice and short? I'm looking. I'm looking at my games. I just want to play like a nice indie and just like hang out. I'm making a full list. Making a full list of potential options. Um. for like five minutes. I have the best snack ever, Apple. If you want, I'll share. What is it? I'm curious. If y'all want me to describe any of those games, by the way, let me know. Um, well, I'll just do it anyways. Fuck it. Once Upon a Jester is like a cute improvisational game where you play as like a cute jester uh, trying to like impress the king. Uh, yeah, you want those games is, uh, shitty mobile games, like the ones that you see ad for, ads for, but, like, as a full game. Uh, Cuisiner just came out. It's, like, a roguelite meets cooking. Uh, Growing Up is a really nice, like, life sim game. And then Storyteller is a really fun, just cute puzzle game where you tell little stories. Sesame seed covered cashews. They are so good. Interesting. I'm not the biggest sesame seed person. I like, I like like a little bit of sesame seeds. Okay, it's looking like we're going to be playing, yeah, you want those games. Which is more than fine by me. I've never actually played it, so... I thought it would be a fun, I thought it would be a fun stream. They're quickly becoming one of my favorite healthy-ish snacks. I need more, like, good healthy snacks. I feel like I just have such a big sweet tooth, so every time that I want a snack, I want something sweet. Although, the captain has been buying, like, he, he works at a pretty big uh, grocery store, so he bought, like, a shit ton of popcorn. <clears throat> and now every now and then he'll just make us popcorn, and that's been really nice. Okay, I'm gonna grab a drink very quick, uh, and then, yeah, then when I come back, it seems like we're gonna be playing Yeah, You Want Those Games, right? So, 
I'll go on a brief BRB. I'll be gone for like less than five minutes. So I'll, I'll put on some music though. So you won't just be left with the void. <laughs> so see you in just a bit, friends.
no, Jesus Christ. <clears throat> I've got to adjust the display. There we go. <laughs> My gosh, that's loud. Spooked me. I'm very easily spooked. Let's just adjust this. There we go. Can I use a controller? Oh, I can't! Hell yeah. Okay. This is funky. Although I am gonna adjust the volume because it's very loud. Okay. We got pin pull. We got number tower, parking lot, cash run, and color lab. Which one do we start with? Pinholes, the one that I've seen the most in ads. Cash run being a very close second. Uh, so you know what? Let's let's start with pinhole. Oh Jesus! There's so many levels. Okay, we've got to find the treasure. I did it! If there's treasure, Stickman will find it if you remove the pin blocking the way. Be careful not to collapse from exhaustion if the treasure is still blocked. I really love how much this plays like a shitty mobile game already. Look at that. Beautiful. Rocks will break apart and disappear if they fall on things other than pins. Stickmen can get hurt by them, so use them only to hit enemies. Yay, we did it! Oh, I only got I only got two stars for that one. How do I get three? <laughs> I got three stars that time. I think it's just how fast you clear it. Alright. Speed, I think. Yeah, so this is the perfect time to, like, vibe. So if anyone has, like, any questions they want to ask, or any particular things they want to talk about, just, like, fire away! Let's, let's just vibe! Let's just have a good time! I'm going to adjust this because it's slightly off center and that's bothering me. I'm too much of a perfectionist for this shit. Yeah, no worries, Jack. Have fun. Okay. I did it. Wolves will take a bite out of Stickman if the pen blocking them is removed. Use things like rocks to defeat them. Okay. Yeah, this is still really loud. <sighs> okay, 
so we've got to kill the wolf. There. Damn. Can't believe this game can deal with wolf murder. Pretty fucked up. I keep getting, like, surprised by my own hand. Which I know is weird to say. But... No, I just missed the three stars. Hello, Dragon Emperor. How are you doing? But I have a friend. Or, not a friend. Well, yes, a friend. But one of my co-workers. Um, my co-workers... My Indian co-workers, some of them have been celebrating, like, Diwali this week. Um, and... Oh no! I fucked it up! Um, and one of them was like, oh, let's do, uh, henna on all the staff. Which is very sweet. Oh, fuck. Okay. I still fucked it up. But, yeah, so it was, we got all very, very nice henna, which is very, very sweet. Okay, I did manage to succeed this one earlier, I just, like, I was able to kill both of them with, like, one thing. I think would be cool if I can do it. <sighs> But yeah, so I've got, like, this beautiful henna design, but I'm not used to having, like, anything on my hands. So it's like... Oh, okay, I did it. There we go. <laughs> so I keep, like, looking down at my hand and, like, seeing henna and being surprised by my own hand. It's like when I got my actual tattoo the first time. Hunters will kick wolves if the pin blocking them is removed. They won't move when they kick, so use things like rocks to defeat them afterwards. I like that you get cute little tips. No! Oh, no, I did it. Okay, cool. I thought I fucked it up. There we go. They take those! <laughs> But yeah, like, if anyone has any questions or anything in particular they want to talk about, now's, now's the time. I keep having these weird spam bots like my shit on Twitter. Like, it's just a group of them. <sighs> And I flagged a few of them, but... Ah! No! Okay. I think we've gotta release that one. So it kills the, that dog. Do we? Oh, the hunter kicks us! What a bitch! Okay. So we've gotta release... This one? Probably. And then that one. And then this one. Okay. See, I'm smart. I can logic my way into shit like this. I should not be having as much fun as I'm having with this really shitty game. Oh no! Wait, 
Hello, Dory. How are you doing? How you be? We be good. I'm currently playing a god awful uh, mobile game. Well, um, mobile game. Uh, mobile game equivalent. Oh, here's the thing. My art, like my character art, is not me. <laughs> my character art is done by the very talented Meek and Rob, who is a very good friend of mine. Um, my art, Genie, is, uh, well, if you look on my Twitter, I have a pretty recent tweet. Um, yes, Shooty, I know you've redeemed it three times. I just, I have a terrible memory. So you need to, like, you, just fucking DM me. DM me exactly what you've redeemed, and I will draw it for you. I just have a terrible memory, so people redeem it, and then I immediately forget what they want. But in my most recent tweet, uh, or not my most recent tweet, but one of my most recent tweets, I did a very, uh, I, I draw... Pokemon that die in Nuzlocke's very poorly. <laughs> That's an example of my crappy artwork. But seriously, Shooty, just like DM me. That way I actually have what you want in writing. Because <sighs> I'll do it. I just, I need to remember what you want. <sighs> oh, there's a goblin. Oh, he's a not nice goblin. I thought he would be friends. Oh. I don't even have to get treasure this time. <laughs> yeah, no, it's not good though. <laughs> it's not good art. Just, you know. I screwed that up. Oopsie. Yeah, this really is like crappy mobile game. <sighs> Again, I'm kind of having fun with it though, to be honest. <laughs> I'm not gonna do probably all 50 stages, but I'll do quite a few. Okay. Um. No! 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 Shit! 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 Okay. I think they all just need to stay where they are, actually. to be moved first. Okay, no, shit. <laughs> it is addicting. It is. Which is why people get crappy games like this. Shoot. <laughs> I love how someone commented on my cleric having a Vaporeon. It's a valid thing to comment on. But let's be real. Cleric Apple would have a Vaporeon. That's her ace, in fact. <sighs> just for the just for the jokes of it all. Uh, okay. That one goes down. I'm not even trying to get the stars anymore. I'm just like... There we go. But yeah, shooty, like, DM me on Discord or something with with what exactly you want. Okay, that'll fall 
call him one of them. No. stays intact. Okay. So we can remove those pins. If I remove that, will it stay? Okay, it will. Bonk! Ah! There we go. Beautiful. Wow. Wow. I'm so good at games. is she? Oh, she bonks me. Okay. He? She? I don't know. Oh, but she'll bonk that. God. Okay. Cool. Trolls will hit goblins with their sticks if the pin blocking them is removed. Interesting. It's like lore. <laughs> We're learning lore for this game. that one first and then release this one sound effect that happens. Maybe today we just play like a variety of different games. Because I want to do like a long stream. But I want to just play like a shit ton of different things. Again, I was very much expecting Pokemon Stadium to take us longer than it did. Okay. 
Oh. Okay. Okay. So we don't need to... do all the pits if there's no, like, treasure or anything. Destroy everything. Does that include me? Do I also get destroyed? fire one. Oh. No, we'll fire two. You just have to wait. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this is weirdly addicting. Oh, there's bombs. Okay. into a bomb. Dude, it just ran into a bomb. Leave that one there then. <laughs> the fact that this dude just kicks dogs is still kind of fucked up. Just saying. Oh, but then there's this one. to get down there somehow. like 25 stages in each game. Oh, I can't have her crash into... To utilize the bombs. Yeah, we'll do like 25 stages of each and then m maybe move on to like a road like or something for a bit. I think so. Whoa, whoa, I'm unlocking so much stuff for Number Tower right now. Alright, 
I did it. The larger your number, the stronger you are in the tower. Take numbers away from the enemies by defeating them. Hi, Death! How are you doing? Okay, I'm not accepting a two-star on the first thing. Great, just chilling out. Hell yeah. Take that one. Let me take that one. Oh my god, you have to be like on the ball just because it takes so long to actually like do the animations. that. Then take that. Like, if you want to get the stars, you need to click that shit immediately. Okay, we want to take six first. But we could also t take a nine, I guess. Do I have to clear all of them? I think I do. <laughs> I love the death animation. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking after this maybe we'll play some cuisine or something. Because it's it's brand new. I've never played it. Is this the <laughs> That game you see in all those fake ads. Basically, it's a game that is a collection of all of those games. It's wonderful. It's actually really fun. Kind of addicting, to be honest. Maybe we just try and do all 50 stages each today. Who knows? Who knows what we will try to achieve? That's an amazing concept. Yeah, like someone created a legitimate game from all the shitty games. <laughs> What's the company that created this, actually? It was created by Monkey Craft Co. Which are the developers behind, like, Klon the Klonoa we make and Katamari Damacy. <laughs> it's created by the same devs as fucking Katamari. I love that. That's so funny. Specifically, the, like, the Katamari remakes. The Katamari remake and the, uh, Klonoa remake. <sighs> I need to play the Klonoa remake. I need to play so many things. I need to take just, like, a week off work. And fucking, like, stream shit. There's so many games I want to play and get through on stream. But I just, I don't have enough time in my week to stream. Which sucks. I want more time in my week to stream. You need to play Deep Rock Galactic. I don't know if I enjoy Deep Rock. I've seen footage of it. I just, I genuinely don't know if I'd like it. Simple, clone yourself. I'm working on it. That is where the concept of the multiple apple seeds came from. Was the thought of just cloning myself. I 
I still need to commission other apple seeds, though. If anyone knows good artists with commissions open, let me know. I think I found an artist to do uh, my next apple seed, though. I won't spoil who, but... Also, these shitty little goblins. I love them. I drew... <laughs> I have a kid at work who, this kid loves monsters. Like, he loves monsters, he loves every anything spooky, like, loves Halloween. Um, so I drew this kid a monster the other day that just looked like, like, essentially a, um, a goblin. And I wanted to take a picture of it. And joke that it was my new goblin now scene I was gonna be rebranding. I called him Gam. Gam the goblin. <laughs> this kid colored all over it, so I don't have the drawing anymore. I could probably I could probably shittily remake it. Very easily. Oh, so I, I still need to take the negative ones? Hang on, hang on. Let me, let me try and recreate this fucking goblin for y'all. Okay? <laughs> let's just, let's, we'll, we'll pause the game for a bit. <laughs> let me, let me try and recreate this. fucking my computer would let me load even just paint <laughs> why isn't why isn't the search thing opening weird it's having issues um okay so let me just Let me just try and put this shitty little goblin I made into perspective for y'all. If. If you guys could actually see the thing. And I can't. You see my window capture. No, I'm perplexed. I will talk about a tabletop character in a minute. I just I need to I need to put in perspective what this what this little guy looked like. Okay, so so we have our canvas here. Okay, I'm just gonna grab. Grab some green. It was like round head. We got it. No, the ears were a bit more like pointed upwards. Or, yeah, kind of like that. And um, tell me my favorite. Tell me your favorite silly guy. I will in a second. Okay, so then I drew like a crappy little shirt. I drew uh, monster hands, which I'm not good at drawing hands. Um, 
this particular monster, uh, I mean, it was, I drew it on a paper <laughs> where it, like, the legs were kind of cut off, but I'll give, I'll give this one shoes just for perspective. Um, hi, Quistel. You came in to me, uh, trying to recreate the monster, aka Goblin, that I drew for a kid at work. <laughs> I work at a daycare for context, and like a two-year-old requested that I draw him a monster. Um, so he had like it was a big a big mouth with big fangs. I don't remember what the eyes looked like. I think the eyes were like like kind of that. And then I made, like, evil, evil eyes. <sighs> this was the monster. <laughs> this was the monster, and I named him Gam. <laughs> or, uh, Gap. What did I say? I think it was Gam. This was, this was my monster that I drew for this kid. And I kind of loved him. I thought he was great. I don't think there was anything else. Oh, there was a tail, actually. I did draw a tail. I think it was just, like, a fairly basic tail, but I'll do, like, a, like a tail like that. Yeah, so this was this was the monster I drew for this kid. He loved it. He thought it was great. This kid was all about goblin supremacy. <laughs> Want to know a messed up children's show fact? I would love to. So yeah, this is my new OC. Um, I'm going to be rebranding this instant to Gam the Goblin here. Um... He's, I don't know what he is, except for a goblin. He's just a little guy. That's, that's all we need to know. That's all we need to know about Gam. <laughs> Anyways, uh, my, going back to the game. My favorite silly little guy tabletop character I have chaos um I've had a lot of dumb mean characters and I know I've talked about a lot of them on stream before so I'm trying to think of the ones that I like, like I haven't talked about um One of my favorite silly little guys was um, an NPC <coughs> I made. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, that's sad. Um, there was a character I made um, for a tabletop RPG known as Masks, A New Generation. Which is, um, a, uh, a superhero tabletop that's inspired by, like, Teen Titans and stuff like that. Um, oh, I thought you meant, like, in the show aimed for toddlers, and I'm like, this, they just let this kid fucking die? Okay. <clears throat> um, but, uh, so I had an NPC for a campaign I was running in this, like, mass tabletop, which, by
by the way, is a tabletop RPG I'd love to run for people. Like, I would love to start a campaign. Probably not on stream, but off stream, of just, like, running masks. Because I really love that system. And the more role-playing aspects to it. Um, but I had a character, uh, because I was creating basically, like, a, like, a My Hero Academia school full of kids. So I made a character who was, his whole thing was that he thought he was a kid that had dog powers. Nah, he was literally just a sentient like, anthropomorphic dog. But his owner had, like, lied to him and convinced him that he was a legitimate... a legitimate dog. <laughs> or a legitimate, like, human. <laughs> he was a fun character just to, like, roleplay and kind of be silly with. Oh, well, that could be enough. I don't think it will. I think I need to wait to use that. Shit. Okay, retry. Um. But yeah. So, it was just this kid who, like, thought he was a legitimate human that was actually a fucking dog. <laughs> And I kind of just loved it. He very much, like, I had him as kind of lovable dog brain. It was great. Oh, 500. Damn. Oh, one of these is 96. Okay. Oh, it's a times three. I thought it was just another times two. I'm like, how am I expected to do this? But that makes that makes sense. Think. I think I want to times three this now. Yeah, that way the minus fifty will still. Believe me, fine. The one who wore the Barbie costume ran a tandem sex business. That's my weird kid show back. Okay. I'm glad we're all full of weird kid show facts. I can't say I have any off the top of my head, but divide it by two. said that I'm gonna have to do math while playing this dumb mobile game game. <sighs> are you sure about that? Death. I will repeat. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? Okay. If you're sure. I'm gonna say it once. Volume warning. your ears any longer. I will keep the model up and do the voice for a bit, but <laughs> Hello! Hi! It's me, Applebee! Everything is working!
use the divided by two as soon as possible. Okay. Because it's it's very loud, even with my mic set on extremely quiet. It's because it uses my webcam mic instead of my actual streamer mic. And also this voice just makes me loud. Uh, I think I need to do at least one of the top twos. If I divide it by two, it still leaves me at 77. Why is this game actually kind of fun? Like, I feel like it should be, you know? <sighs> I didn't mean to press that. I mean, if anyone wants to donate, I'm not gonna say no. <laughs> if anyone wants to donate, it could help me get a better model. I need a nice one. <laughs> this model is Willy Sculpt. That's what I meant to press. It was the VTuber Awards, but. Um, right, right. two, minus two, plus ten. Oh, steals money to make model worse. <laughs> it would be fun to have just like a sliding scale of worse and worse models. <laughs> I think that would be really funny, actually. <laughs> Like, I've got this one, and then I've got one that's like, it's not even colored in. <sighs> Forfeit all mortal possessions to Goblin? I already have. I'm already Goblin. Goblin for life. Um... amount of math I have to do here is not... Oh, I should have done the times three first, actually. I don't know. Okay. I think I'm still okay. But I want to do the divided by two as soon as possible. Okay. Imagine having possessions. Right? My mom called me this morning. Which I said earlier, it was my mom's birthday yesterday, so her and I had a good talk on the phone this morning. Um, and like, she was asking me, oh, so like, what do you want for Christmas? What can you and the captain like use for your apartment? I'm like, I don't, you don't fucking have anything. I could use literally whatever. 
We have, like, hardly anything. Please give us shit. I, I feel like, you know, we own a lot of shit, but none of it is actually practical. Like, why would I own practical stuff when instead I could buy, like, five different, uh... Pokemon plushies, you know? <laughs> Vintage waffle iron it is. I would love a waffle iron, to be honest. I used to have one uh, that my that the captain actually gave my ex when my ex and I moved in together. It was a housewarming slash birthday gift for my ex. The captain and I, uh, somewhat recently bought... <clears throat> um. Okay, I was wondering how we do the, like... The vibes when it was an odd number. Um... Um, but we recently bought, like, a fondue kit, which was so nice. We had a really cute, like, fondue date. <laughs> it was just so cute. We, like, bought strawberries and kiwis and bananas and apples and just, like, had some chocolate fondue. really nice. Uh, fuck. I think I need to do the times five and then, like, what happens? What happens? <laughs> okay. You can't get to zero, apparently. Okay. So, I've gotta fight that first. I'm still tough. But nah, I'd love a waffle maker again. I miss our old waffle maker. My old waffle maker. Give me strength. Buys you a house. I would love a house. <laughs> I can't afford to have a house at this current point in time. But, I would like one, eventually. The captain's dream is that uh, one day we'll inherit his, like, parents' house. Which would be nice. They have a very nice house. Okay. Your AV to HDMI converter came in today? Hell yeah. What is the first thing you're gonna do with it? That was always my question, like, when I got my, uh, that's not gonna be enough, shit. Um, when I got, like, my new PC, the first question I ask myself is like, okay, what am I going to stream first? For me, that answer was Spyro. Which I still need to play the third game, actually. I was planning on starting that after beating Pokemon Stadium 2, which is now officially beat. So, yeah, like, I, how do I, okay, I've got 
gotta do that first. Robin's been perfectly at level. Okay, it kills me. Interesting. I'm also gonna swap my model back to what it's supposed to be. <laughs> I feel like I need I need to set a timer for everything is worse now. Like I need to do the voice for a certain amount of time. It's mostly fun for the for the ear attack. <laughs> the voice I can only keep up for so long. It's hard on the throat. This voice. It hurts. Okay, there we go. Back we are. There. Um. But yeah, I was like, when I got my PC, the first thing I wanted to stream was Spyro Reignited. It was like, priority number one, stream-wise for me. that times three. Can I? Sorry, brain is trying to do math. I'm not good at math. stream list is just insanely long. I have way too many things that I want to stream. And again, not enough time in which to stream it. What I should have done, honestly, and I regret not now, is taking, like, I should have taken, like, a week off before I started my, well, not so new now, but new at the time job. So that I could have just like, had a week of streaming. I think, I think that would have been fun. But, oh, shoot. Um, okay. Do that first. Can we do this to get great strength? I think I need to do this first. I don't know. Yeah, if I beat this up and divide in half, I still have more than enough. There we go. Um. <laughs> but.
Uh, let's move on to the next game. Let's do parking lot. <laughs> oh, this one only has 25 things. Cool. Um. But yeah, I just like, I have so many games I want to play. And not enough time to play them. Speaking of, gotta go. See ya, Dapple. Bye-bye. Coins I'm getting. What are the coins for? What can I do with the coins? There's a gotcha? Why is there gotcha aspects? What are the plates for? Got different. I can do Stickman Rookie. Intelligent Rookie. Huh. What are the missions? Oh. So you get like titles and shit. to know. <laughs> Apparently we don't want the cars to crash. That's a bad thing, I guess. But it's okay if they crash just for a little bit so that they don't crash into other things. but to be honest I'm kind of sleepy so I might just like kind of vibe after this like I'll, I'll do all 25 things but then I might just rest there we go. maybe I'll do another stream later I can do another stream a little later in the evening. We'll see. Okay. That one can go. Now that one. 
that one. I love how just bumping these cars around is a perfectly valid strategy. Oh. White Lightning Hauling! Thank you so much for following! Welcome to the Orchard Friend! Hello! just because I didn't sleep well but we're playing some crappy uh, mobile game things uh, and having actually a really fun time like more fun than I feel like I should be having oh that glitched for a second it seemed mm. Mm. See, the completionist in me is like, it's not hard to complete all these games. So what if, what if I just did that? I don't know if I will, because I feel like I probably should nap, but. <sighs> Parking lot here at least trying to get full things on each one. I'm just trying to do it. Um, okay, now we can get that one out. Oops. That one can go like that. That can go like that. Oops. Oops. Nice! Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just try and do all these mini games. I'm invested. I'm having fun. Screw it. I just might need some, like, coffee or something. <laughs> oh, nice! phone games I expected there all to be, but I feel like there's less than I expected, to be honest. It's your stream and you decide the source material. Yeah. I'm aware. Oh, side. I'm, I'm very good at this one, I think. I mean, in terms of just general, like, my brain doesn't need to figure out the puzzle. Appleseed holds up in the Monster Girl manual. Oh, do I have to avoid hitting the pedestrians now? That might be harder. This bitch gets out of the way. They roam the areas with knives in the hand and will be very angry if you hit them with a car. <laughs> I don't know why that's making me laugh so much. I think it's just like, ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, gosh, dang it. Ah, Steve over here hit me with a car. I'm gonna slash his tires. I'm like, okay. Move out of my way. I, I avoided him. <sighs> I'm kind of surprised I avoided him. There we go. It's the 
FNAF purple guy. <laughs> I don't know enough about FNAF. Has anyone seen the FNAF movie? Is it good? I've been hearing it's... Oh. He got angry. I don't know what that means if he gets angry. But... Yeah, no, I've heard it's good. That's why I'm like... That's why I want to ask. If anyone's, like, seen it. Because <laughs> I have heard it's good. But I'm not, like, I'm not a FNAF fan. So, I don't know if I would enjoy it. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> you watched it and you found it pretty good. Okay, that's good. I'm also not a horror fan, so chances are I just, I won't like it, period. But... genuinely good, so I wanted other people's opinions. <sighs> Look, sometimes you just want a weird-ass pick for a fighting game. It's like me with really wanting Cooking Mama to be added to Smash. I think, I think she would be re legitimately a good pick. And I'm not saying that as a joke. I think with the fire in Cooking Mama's eyes, when you screw up a recipe, Mama would be an excellent addition to Smash Bros. fit trainer where it's like it's a character you don't expect because you're like how are they gonna make a move set out of this but then they manage to do it and you're like hell yeah not these guys are angry well I mean they are angry because you hit them with a the car but they also have knives like that's important to mention I guess and I just find that really funny the fact that you have to mention that they have knives to be as an important detail is just it, it's funny to me during the whole movie by the same character. See, I'm a baby. Like, jump scares are terrifying to me. I would much rather do, like, slow building atmosphere core than watch something where I get jump scared. I can't do jump scares. It's a PG-13 so no gore. Okay. 
move so I can get my cars out. Thank you. This is mainly just unexpected. Yeah, I mean, that's fair. <clears throat> Hate it when you accidentally crash your car into another car. Man, hate it when that happens. Um, that needs to move, so that can 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 move. So that can move. <laughs> there we go. I think if I had to pick one of these games that I'm the best at so far, the parking lot here. I'm very good at just figuring out, like, oh yeah, this one can go here right now. lot's a goddamn mess though I gotta say if this was an actual parking lot I would have such anxiety going through it like I feel like there should be a parking attendant and the fact that they don't have one is honestly more than a little irresponsible for the captain that was supposed to get here like a few days ago but was like super late Hydrate, you bastard. Hydrate. which we were both kind of disappointed by um it showed up literally moments after he left for work today i will hydrate i will check my posture i will stretch thank you shooty really need a parking attendant. Um. Okay, that one's out. That one can go out. That one can go out. Not quite that one yet. This one moves in more. Then I can. Um. 
one. I'm not even like paying attention to where the stabby guys are and I feel like I should be. <sighs> That's what I'm gonna call them from now on. They're the stabby guys. But like this parking lot is insanity. Y'all really need to hire a parking attendant because this is, this is frick up. I'm glad there's no limit to how many times these cars are allowed to crash into one another. Because <laughs> I feel like if there was, I would not be good at this. take those. Okay, now we need to get these guys out, but we need to time this right. Oh, no, no, no! Oh, okay, thank god. Whew! I was really worried I was gonna fuck everything up there. <sighs> Here too. one's supposed to get out without hitting the dude. Oh, there we go. Just was a very tight fit is all. I feel. <laughs> there we go. Did it! Woo! Now we've got the last one. Okay. Look at how many we can take out straight off the hop. Oh, that one has a wall in the way. Never mind. See, I like things like, I like puzzles where there's multiple solutions. That's my favorite type of puzzle things. So something like this where I can like see the multiple solutions and ways I could solve the puzzle, that's that's the type of shit I love. Oh, 
Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. love how durable these cars are. They don't mind getting squashed a little bit. It's fine. Start tackling this shit over here. Get that one out. Oop. Get that one out. Everything's fine. <sighs> we just lightly hit Gerald's foot. It's fine, guys. It's fine. Don't worry about it. My hands are getting so sweaty. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so glad that crashed, actually. Nice. You ever get thankful that you crashed your car? <laughs> it's me playing this game. feel a weird amount of relief when your car crashes into something. I think I'm not able to move it. Ah, no! Fuck! No, I was doing so good! Shit! God damn it. Uh, okay, I need 
to start by taking out all the ones that I know I can take out because there were some. I just don't remember which ones. That one, that one. I'm doing well. I am uh, a little sleepy, but that's nothing new. I usually am, so. Find a way to I'm position this one. Yeah, that one out, which is good. I should start by trying to get the big ones out, actually. That should be my strat. I'm just not thinking. <laughs> Period. <laughs> uh, I'm not good at thinking. <laughs> for these kind of games always infuriates me when they play bad on purpose. Yeah, that's fair. Well, this is like a Steam game that's just a compilation of like a ton of these types of games. And it's actually kind of really fun. Like I'm having a blast. Okay, um, I need to try and tackle things on this side. Move that guy out of the way. Ah! Frick. <laughs> okay, that was just poor. 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 Shit. <laughs> that was me being dumb. I just timed that poorly. That's all that was. No, I'm actually, it's, it, it's surprisingly fun. Like, <clears throat> fuck it. Now I'm, now I'm nervous. Now I've got like nerves in my brain. So I keep hitting these stupid dudes. Whichever ones I can just automatically get out. But that's tricky. get that yellow one. Just <clears throat> try to get out as many at different exits as you can.
Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I'm not getting angry. You're getting angry. the only two I need to get out that way. Uh, these ones down here, but that's not too bad. Oop. He's fine. He didn't get mad. Everything's fine. of those out, which is good. That one can go there. That one can go there. Um. I'm, I'm, I'm figuring this out. I'm figuring this out one way or another. Okay, so far. This one needs to go that way too. Wait. Oh shit. Uh, no, no, no. Okay. Thank God he crashed. Thank God he crashed because I was very worried that that wouldn't work out.
Ugh, these stupid... I was doing so well at this game. And then these stupid dudes and their stupid, like, purpleness just fucked everything up. <sighs> and now I'm upset. conversation while I'm doing this shit. I need, like, something to focus on, aside from just the infuriation. Um, what's a good topic of conversation? What's new in my life? Um, Sound of Music. That was her uh, birthday present from me, is Sound of Music tickets. And then she was like, oh, I'll take you out to dinner beforehand, and that'll be my birthday present to you. <sighs> or birthday dinner. She'll buy me a present too, knowing her, but... <sighs> Sound of Music on December 8th. Um, <clears throat> I'm really looking forward to it. I think it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be good. I've never seen Sound of Music before, so. Or, I've never seen a live version of Sound of Music. I've watched, like, a film. But I don't know if my mom has either, actually. So that'll be good. And then Book of Mormon is coming again to my city. So I'm trying to get tickets to go see that, but they're really expensive. Like way more expensive than the last time Book of Mormon came here. Which I mean, good for them, but they're <clears throat> making money able to increase the ticket price, but even for like really shitty seats, it's super expensive, which sucks. If anyone has, like, questions or anything, please ask them, because it will give my me something to, like, talk about. Because right now my brain's just like, I need to be focused. I need to focus on doing this right <sighs> and well.
Um. I have like a D and D campaign that I've been itching to start. Some of my IRL friends and it's like I we were supposed to start it a while back but one of the players had a baby so you know valid reason to put it on kind of delay for now but it's like I just I want to play d and I miss I miss it I haven't played I haven't DM'd d and in like ages. Like I feel like it's been so long since I've DM'd anything. Probably isn't actually that long, but it feels like it's been years. this incredibly stressful because I'm not good at timing. <laughs> against me. Fucked up. <laughs> Straight up. Fricked up. so close to finishing this and then I failed at the last minute and now I'm very sad. <sighs> if I fail this one more time I might just end stream <laughs> or give up on at least this particular minigame because I'm, I'm gonna get frustrated. Did you sleep well at least Nagisa? I hope you did. I 
just want to get these big boys out as soon as possible. And ideally try and clear these annoying ones that have to go like past all these purple dudes. If I can get those ones out of the way like as soon as possible then that's good. That was on me, that was just me not realizing that that's... I thought it would crash into something. That one, that one was my stupid. I'll admit that. this game is very nice. Unlike the mobile ads that this game is based off of, which typically have uh, little to no music. <laughs> so, the fact that there is music is nice. <clears throat> and the fact that the music is actually good is nicer. section. very fun to figure out the various strategies for. <laughs> This 
is just making me have like an a rational hatred for cars. <laughs> I love puzzles like this. I love puzzles where there's multiple ways to solve it. That's the type of puzzle games I really like. Where you're given like, here's the puzzle, and here's several different ways you can solve said puzzle. Think that would get bumped again, but that's fine. It worked out timing wise. That's all that matters. Yeah, I want to try and do all the ones that get out. idea of wielding something that could kill people. Like, why would I want to drive if I have the potential to very easily murder someone? Um, okay, he got upsetty, but it's fine. He got a little upsetty spaghetti, but all is well. We're still okay. Okay, this one's gonna crash over here. I would like them to crash, that way I can just get like a feasible look at how short the distance is. That's true, people are like 50 points, right? The captain, my partner, has like a legitimate sliding scale for that. Which we've joked about because we're terrible. <laughs> um, I can't remember exactly what it is, but it's something like babies are 50, old people are 30. <sighs> okay. We're getting close again. And I don't want to fuck it up. I really, really don't want to fuck it up. People on bikes, 100. I don't know. I'll have to ask him. down again. <sighs> this is stressful. 
Like this is legitimately giving me actual stress and I feel like it shouldn't. so close. If I manage, like, if I fuck this up this close to the end somehow, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> okay. This dude down below is gonna be what fucks me. Okay. One. Oh, can I? No, I can't go the other way. I thought I could for a second. I'm like, am I actively choosing the harder way? There we go! I did it! Finally! Holy shit! <gasps> My god! Ugh. I'm a parking lot expert. I did all the parking lot things. And now I've got rank up challenge. Now I can change my title plate. Oh. I thought I got parking lot expert as big. <sighs> okay, stack your cash to get over the obstacles. I wish hosting was a thing still. That's so fair. I miss hosting. Okay. Oh, okay, so you spend cash to get over different obstacles. Samich Lady, thank you so much for following. Welcome to the orchard. Or Sam Mock Lady? Okay. So. Oh. Oh, okay. So you've gotta use your money to get over over the obstacles. I don't want the poison. Yeah, it's just a mix of a lot of phone games, but done even better. Use the cash you get to make a path over obstacles and don't be cheap. If you bang into obstacles, it'll hurt. Don't be cheap, but okay, the more money you have, I think equates to the more stars you get. So and then you get a different house to live with your beloved, I guess. But yeah, it's just a ton of, like, mobile phone games, but designed to be actually fun and good. Okay. Uh, shit. Oh, fuck. No! Ah! So you want to try and do it using as little money as possible, ideally. Okay. Interesting. I wish the end things were a bit quicker. They go by very slowly. But I suppose that's realistic to mobile phone games. Ah! 
shit, shit, shit. No, fuck. Okay. Okay, I finished with normal. My goal was to do at least 25 stages of each game. Some only have 25, while others have 50. So. two stars on any of these so far. Oh, that's not true. I got three stars on the very first one. Three stars on that one. I don't get it though. Our house looks exactly the same. Okay, so I don't need to make it all in one big go. I can just kind of do like that, 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 like that. Da 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 da. enough to keep you in the air. Okay. I understand. I, I see what this game's putting down. I'm, I'm picking up what this game's putting down. Oh, whoops. I missed, I missed some cash. I was rich there for a second. Oh, I'm so wealthy. Look at all my fat stacks of money. Holy frig. I'm rich, y'all. I have so much money for my babe. Look, we got a pool now. What the fuck? I can afford a pool. I'm so wealthy. Are money. It's a money pool. I'm gonna pour my fat stacks of cash in there. Ooh, there's money up there. Okay, so I wanna like. Okay. 
Okay. Level 11. Casino or study? What? Uh, I want study. I just want money gains. So now there's like paths that will get me more money? If I go to the casino, I have a chance of getting like... I have a chance of getting a shit ton of money at the casino, but it's like a risk reward sort of thing. No, I would rather just study. I'm a good student. I wasn't a good student. I skipped a lot of classes in university. <laughs> But look, he's so wealthy. We got a pool again! nice not seeing ads pop up every single time I do anything. Oop, I missed the fat stack of money again. Shit. Okay. So now I can get a job. Well, get to like I'll do 25 of each thing and then probably call a stream there the idea that, you know, working at a job will make you rich. That's a cute concept. What a funny fantasy game this is. <sighs> Virus. A vaccine. Here, 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 folks. Getting your COVID vaccine makes you rich. Get vaccinated. That's what this, that's what this game's trying to tell you. Getting your COVID vaccine 100% makes you rich. Oh, I'm a celebrity. Whoa, that's how rich I am. rich enough that like everyone in the freaking world knows my name. What does celebrity get you? I better have two pools. Oh shit. I got two girlfriends. Celebrity means you go into a loving poly relationship. Great. <laughs> take is that you just got bitches crawling off your arm, but I like my idea better. 
This is probably my least favorite game so far, I've got to be honest. It's not exactly very thrilling gameplay. Not that the others were thrilling, but... down after every one of these walls. There's cash. I like cash. Ah! Frick. Okay. So that's the downside of going on the underpath is that there's spikes. And naturally, we don't want spikes. So I might just go on the upper path. It seems like it's slightly less money, but probably overall safer. But I am gonna get COVID vaccinated, baby! I still- just- ah! Fuck. I don't understand the virus versus vaccine. One more game after this, and then. Then honestly, I think I've played enough of this game. Maybe I'll clear the other ones my own time, but I'll, I'll consider this game a beaten game. So what, what is the like, money angel thing. I take that. I will stretch and check my posture. Thank you, shitty. Hydrate, you bastard! Hydrate! <sighs> uh, the money angel thing I take to be, like, you have the potential to lose money. But I suppose I should actually try and figure it out. I'm gonna go to the casino. I'm gonna see what... But it does. Oh, okay. So you have a chance of getting like a shit ton of money or a chance of like losing money. That's what it is. Yeah, so like that time I got a fat stack of money. Why does a robbery have a chance to like give you a fat stack of money? 
Is that like the settlement? this game and then we just have the colors one after this I think I keep putting shit on the top you do believe that you'd be committing a robbery no this game's too pure I'm a good citizen. I would never commit a crime. I'm not Rogue Appleseed. I don't know how to do crime. for this one you kind of need to like you either need to like really expertly time out each of your steps or you need to get like this stack like I'm worried I'm not I don't yeah I don't have enough okay so you need to really hard. Okay. Nope, fuck. I don't think you can do it on just this, like, starting stuff. I'll try, but... Oh, I got it. Hell yeah. Okay, cool. commit crimes. I feel like that's Rogue Appleseed's model. Rogue Appleseed is absolutely gonna be like gay ass apple. I mean they're all a little gay, but but Rogue Appleseed's gonna be like like, exclusively attracted to girls, gay. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm too into dick for that. <laughs> Sorry, I was fixing something. Game. Is it big on TikTok? I don't use TikTok enough. Yeah, to be honest, it's kind of fun. Oh, I'm gorgeous. Ooh, what does gorgeous get me? That's better than celebrity being gorgeous? 
Oh my god, look at all my monogamous partners. Or poly partners. A opposite of monogamous. Again, that's what I envision. It's not that I have a shit ton of side bitches. It's that they're all my loving polyamorous partners. <laughs> Harem. I mean, yeah. Harem's too obvious, though. I want it to be all my loving poly partners. I'm gorgeous again. So much money. You have yet to complete getting a shooty form for every element of the periodic table. I mean, I want to get a sh apple seed form for every single, like, well, at least every single D and D class. Ah, oh, this one is fifty. Okay, we'll just do twenty-five. I'm gonna sleep. I want on a nap. I did it! Wow! There are some non... Like... Um... D&D classes that I have thought about getting grapple though. Where are the ads? <laughs> Hi, Link! It's, it's a game. It's a game designed. It's a game designed to not have ads. Okay, let's pour the blue out. How am I supposed to get more jams without ads? <laughs> Ain't that the question? up to 25 and then I think I'm I'm gonna call the stream there I want to have a nap oh uh, you know having a good vibe date I'm sleepy though I want a nap to find artists to commission for new apple seed forms. I really want to get a new one, but I just, there's so many artists that like, I want to commission. Uh, I don't know if I will be free next week, Link, because I've got like a workshop thing and then also an appointment next week. But the week after, I could probably Like, get, get me your heart. Wish I was good at baking. I just like to bake. I don't know if I'm actually that good. People tell me my food's good, so. I don't know. I think that counts for something. People say that your food is good. 
<laughs> that must mean that it's at least not bad. for it, I guess? I don't know why I poured it in that one. And there's the entire thing. Um. Mm. Ah. Shit. I didn't need to do that. My bed. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I like I'm someone that, like, I very much like to make things for people, and food is something that's so easy to make for people. Like, it's... I can't do a lot of crafty things super well, so it's like... Yeah, food and baking things and cooking for people is kind of like my way of doing that love language, but... <laughs> I'm not saying something since I've been taught to do it professionally. I've done, like... I've done a few cooking classes, but I haven't, like, nothing super professional. Ooh, now we have a yellow. Cool. Oh. I was not supposed to pour the yellow in there, I guess? Okay. She did not like that. Like, how dare you pour the yellow in there? And I'm like, I'm just trying to do what I think is right. And she's like, well, it wasn't right. You fucked up. There we go. Don't care about the amount of stars I'm getting. At this point, I'm sleepy. And I'm just kind of going through the motions. For those who haven't though, on Monday I'm going to be doing like a big VTuber sorting list thing where I'm sorting VTubers into Pokemon types and I'm going to be giving them like shitty little Pokedex descriptions and everything so if you haven't dropped your PNG you should do so. Don't tape me! Don't tape me to the ceiling! Don't do that! I need my arms! How am I supposed to cook and bake tonight if I can't move because I'm taped to the ceiling? <sighs> um... I have so many projects I'm working on. constantly need to be doing something. I constantly need to be working on, like, the next thing. I can't just, like, give myself time to rest. That's illegal. <clears throat> rest is Oh, 
gravitate to this game. I mean, I can understand why it sounds like the type of thing that TikTok would gravitate to, but I'm just, I'm wondering why. What is it about this game? Is it because it's just like shitty m mobile games, but not? <laughs> I'm just a workaholic. I I need to constantly be doing stuff. And I find it difficult to rest. you off for not taking care of yourself. I think I read that already, actually. Yeah, I just, I don't know. I, I like to do things. I like to keep busy. I like to have projects to work on. <clears throat> My problem is that I do that literally all the time and then get burned out. I'm waiting for this one to become hard. I feel like there's supposed to be a ramp up in difficulty and I'm just, it's not happening. Yeah, I think I'm, I think I'm gonna end stream after these last two. I'm really sleepy. I've been going for like a solid three and a half hours. Oh, it is getting harder. It's just with this game, it's, it's hard to have. No, oh, that's fair. put this game on my list of cleared games, by the way. Like, games that we've beaten on stream. I know technically I haven't beaten it, because it's like, there's still more things to do, but like, I've gotten the gist. I don't feel like there's much else this game can throw at me. folks for joining. I'm sorry. I would have liked to continue for longer. I'm just, I'm sleepy. I want to have a nap. Yeah. No, no. That's fair, Shady. for joining. I'm gonna go have a nap. That's gonna be great. 
Tomorrow, we're going to be doing Bread and Fred with Arknon. Uh, probably around 1 p.m. CST, I think. And then I never really decided on a time. So we should probably do that. I think that's a good idea. <laughs> but, either way. Uh, yeah! Yeah! Ooh, are we going to raid? We are going to raid. I know so many folks. Um. We're gonna raid Nagisa. Hey, Dr. Nagisa is a fellow member of my stream team, Mythical Menagerie. She's playing some old school RuneScape right now. So we're gonna send the love her way. Because Nagisa is lovely and we love her. <laughs> Thank you guys again for joining. I'll see you tomorrow for Bread and Fred. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you then. Bye bye, folks.